Hey there, this is Lee from One Month, and I wanted to do a really quick video talking about the difference between local, which is also known as development, and production, which in our classes is usually Heroku. And what happens is a lot of times students can get confused about what to expect from those environments. So I found this image, it's four, I, I have no idea, but I think that I can use it to illustrate what happens. So your local development environment, your computer that you're programming on, is where you write your code and you test it and it's kind of think of it as your playground you can break it you could do it in any crazy way you want and it's separated it's isolated so if we look at this picture you know local has storage and, and it's there and it's never local never goes to production it's it's just completely different it's a completely different environment they're not connected and this also it, this uh, graphic has the example of a staging project, which is something else that you could do. Um, we use it in our development workflow. We go from local, then we push our changes up to GitHub, and after it goes to GitHub and it passes some tests, it gets pushed into staging, which is completely separate from local, and we have some scripts that make fake data and put data in the staging project so that we can test that. And once it's been tested, we push it to production, which is completely separate <clears throat> and has completely separate data. So what this means is anything you do locally will not be reflected in staging or production data-wise. So you have to think about your app as two things, code and data. Code is what makes things happen. Data is what we're changing when we make things happen. So in our case, data would be user profiles, um, images, um, things of that nature. And the code is our styles and our um, controller files and things like that. So those, when we push them up to production, change but we don't have the same data in production. And that's so that local can be a playground and production is kind of a quote unquote known good environment. If it's in production, it's a completely new black box, if you will. So you need to take your data from your local project and also upload it to production if you want it there. Or if you're just playing around on local, you don't need to put it in production. 